Hello! Shadowcat back with the Rim of Time. And last time we were here, we brought in the last of our harvest, preparing ourselves for the winter, and we're pretty well prepared at this point. Not to mention that we had a Manhunter pack that came in and fed us rather well. So we're going to be doing pretty good on that front. We have meat, we have vegetables, we have everything we're going to need for the coming winter. And winter is what we've got. It's the end of September. We already have a little bit of snow on the ground, but we're going to get a whole lot more real soon. So we don't have to worry about that. The rest of it is going to be research. So we already we changed our, our work priorities. Research is now a number one priority for everyone. Just like growing is, just like construction mostly is. Because, you know, we need to get these things done. And so that's what we're going to do. We've been getting a bit more research done on various things, but there's still a lot to go. I mean, just to look at our, the e earliest research that we still have to get. We do not have smoke pop packs yet. That's an easy one. There's still a bit of magic to, re to be um, researched. That's done. That's done. That's done. Under... Um, bad hygiene, we still have a few things that we need that'll just, you know, add to our creature comforts. Power showers, smart toilets, you know, these things um, will grant extra comfort. They're nice. Um, this is... I can't even read all of that. Um, we still need to get this done, though. We haven't even unlocked this. Advanced computing... This will unlock a brand new computer system that we can add into our research room. And that will enhance our research even further. So I kind of want that. Maybe we should be working on that, because right now we're doing quick draw. Yeah, I'm going to change our research. Uh, prediction of a psychic soothe? Okay, that's fine. We'll, we'll take it. Yeah, and all of our outside plants are dying. It's fine. We got everything that we could out of them. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Alright. Uh, let's see. Starvation by with starving? Well, go get something to eat then. We have plenty of food. Right, we have all the meals over here. We have cheese. Um, I really feel like cheese should actually be in here somewhere. I don't even know if they're allowed to eat cheese, because otherwise, why would it be there? Let's look at that. Um, this button. Food restrictions. Okay, cheese. No, no one is allowed to eat cheese. Let's fix that. Okay, you are allowed to eat cheese if you want to eat cheese. Cheese has got to be better than, um... It's got to be better than nutrient paste anyway. Alright, over here in the prison, we still got a few people. Is there anybody here that I really want, or am I just keeping you for no reason? Um... No, I don't really want you. I don't have time to deal with you. We're being raided by Altara. And... They've, uh, they've scattered all over the place. Great. That's, that's gonna be great. Um, here's what we're gonna have to do. Bring everybody here. And all of my non-violence, you need to report directly to the hospital. Things are about to get really hairy here. Okay, um, one thing that we're going to have to do, Vadim is already wounded. Oh yeah, okay, so... Here's what I'm going to have to do. Number one, all animals are going to be set to attack. This is one of those times where I really have to trust you. 
okay? I have to trust you and what you can do. After that, search and destroy. Search and destroy ranged and search and destroy melee. Okay? This is gonna be awful. This is gonna get really bad. Okay, you guys are gonna come here and you are not going to search and destroy. Here we go. And that's all I can do. They're scattered everywhere. There's no way that I can micromanage all of this. All I can do is try to save people. Harris is taking care of him. That was big. Okay, hold on. Colonist needs rescue. Apparently a lot of colonists need rescue. Um, if we're gonna save anybody, we have to start saving people. So, Fox. Flame is up here and needs rescue. Who else? Pilar is up here and needs rescue, or down here, I guess, and needs rescue. Um, Spud. You. Oh, Hay House is also down. Okay, you go rescue Hay House. Um, who else do I have? Anna. You go rescue Pilar. And Pandora is down. May, you're gonna have to go rescue Pandora. Where, 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 where? Here. Okay. Rescue Pandora. Baud is down. Well, I've already got you selected, so... We'll do that. Okay, a bush is not really cover. Major break risk. Petros has gone berserk? We don't have time for that. Oh. Seven, I don't know why you're using a knife. Okay, they're fleeing. They're fleeing. Um... Let them flee. Let them flee. Because I don't I don't want to have chase them down. Okay, that should clear everyone out. Bring everyone back. Let them go. Sven is dead. He got his head blown off, apparently. Alright, um, I just have to release everyone at this point. We have fires everywhere. Anna, you're fleeing. But I need you to help rescue people. I 
I need you to help rescue. Mister, what happened to you? Gunshot with a carbine. Who shot you? Drinking beer. No, you're not. Rescue mister. There's so many people that are down. I don't even know if we can rescue everyone. Um, I need to suspend this. Now, uh, let's see. I have people that need to be rescued. May is beating a fire out over there. I have other things for you to do. No, not that. I need you to rescue Baud. Who else? Alright. Um, everyone down here. Do I have anyone else down here? No, I really don't. And he wants to get out. That's fine. Let him go. You! Beating fire out. No, I need you to rescue. Over here. Um... I don't need everybody running to take care of the fires. Lissa tending to Bravo? Oh, that's one of our animals. Um... Our people need it more, but our people are being tended, apparently. You're rescuing Hay House. Or no, you're rescuing him. Um, Hay House, how much longer do you have? Eight hours. Uh, we'll be able to tend to you. Montoya's being... Oh! The theater's on fire! Wonderful! I don't know if we can replace that or not. Anna, what are you doing? Beating fire? Oh, no, you're not. Wait, where'd he go? Oh, I guess we got everyone. Okay, one of the, um, one of the animals rescued. Good. Okay, in that case, yes, I'll let you go ahead and put out fires. Actually, no, you're my best, one of my best doctors. You don't need to be putting out fires. Um, doctors. Best doctors. What do we want to do? Like, anyone that's 10 and up? Say that anyone that is 10 and up doesn't need to go fight fires. Go doctor! Okay, you are more valuable here than you are anywhere else. And then there's seven. Um... Please bring his body over here. Actually, wait, no, don't do that. Uh, he'll he'll get buried, and I want to bury him. I need to turn back time. What was that? Harris is going on a nature retreat. You are so bloody useless. Um, Anna, I need you to come over here. I know, I know, I know, I literally just said that I need you doctoring, but I need you over here. Colonist needs rescue Pandora? You're gonna die in two hours. Um, white. Having a bath. I need you over here. You are one of the very few that is trained as a yellow Aja. I need you to heal. I didn't buy any time. Rescue. You're right here.
Anna, I need you to turn back time. Done. Okay, we've got you back. Now Anna's down too, but seven is not at any kind of risk. To mention, you need to be rescued too, so you can be treated. You got shot. Rescue Anna first. Seven's gonna be fine. Anna still needs treatment. Well, that was bad for us. We survived it, though. I mean, all things considered, we did well. But it could have gone better. It would have been better if we weren't raided at all. I mean, I really think that was, um... That was rather rude. It's like everybody wants to be Arthur Hawkwing. And so we get to pay the price for it. Except this isn't the original Tarvalin and we're not being sieged for that long. Disease infection. Yeah, that's coming. And even though you're the one who just got the, um, the infection, you decide you're going to wander off? No, 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 no. That's not how this works. You sit your ass in bed. Medical emergency, Pilar. Okay, you're treated. You just had extreme blood loss. You're going to recover. You, same thing. Also, you've lost your arm and your leg. Do we have anything to replace that with? Actually, we do. We do have that. Um, with everybody more or less treated, I need to start turning off doctors. Predictions, something else is going to crash? There's a lot going on here. Let's clear some of these things out. Um, nature retreat, yeah, we can get rid of that. Animal sitting, yeah, infection will leave. The prediction, I don't care. Okay, so I need to turn doctors off and then turn them back on. You doctor, you doctor, you doctor, you doctor, you can doctor. And that's going to be the end of it. Okay. Let's take a look at our injuries. Alright, who was it that lost literally an arm and a leg? You. Okay. So, you're going to need to have a prosthetic leg on the left. Grizzly Bear Revenge! Hold on a second. You also need to have an arm on the right. So, prosthetic arm on the right. Now, where is this bear? Oh, Harris, you picked a fight with a bear. This is your nature retreat. You're going to get mauled by a bear. Nope, you're actually going to save it at the last second. Well, make sure to put it out of your misery. And what was this? That's something about a resource pod crashing. What is it and what's in it? Um, it's got chocolate in it. Okay, uh, we'll take that. Not going to ask questions. There's more slag on the ground to be picked up.
and there's a lot to be done on the medical front here. When it comes to making all of these, um, these prosthetics, I'm wondering if maybe we should be stepping up the number because we have a lot to do. How many other injuries do we have? A burn, gunshots, burns. You lost a kidney. Do we have a kidney to give you? Um, install a surrogate kidney. Yes, we can do that. Install a right kidney. Let's take a look at the rest. You're fine. You will be fine. You're still bleeding, though. Um, yeah, you're missing a bunch of toes. I can't fix that. You're missing a toe as well. Uh, were you ever tended? You were tended. And you're not doing very well. No, wait. You're actually doing very well. I take it back. You could be doing better, though. I want you to come and rest over here. These are actual medical beds, which will get a bonus from the monitor next to them. You're going to be fine. You're going to be fine. You're going to be fine. You have been paralyzed. I cannot fix that. Um, mister, you got shot up a bunch. But you're going to be fine, too. Now, a bionic spine is possible, but I don't think that we can do it. I don't think, anyway. Can we do a spine? No, we cannot do a spine yet. Let's see if I can find it. Um, spine. So this is for doing animal spines. Prosthetics? Um, there's a bionic spine. We have the ability to do this. We just don't have the research yet. Alright, well, at this point, I just have to let things go, I think. Baud, where are you? How are you? Um, Harris, are you still on your nature retreat? No, you're not still on your nature retreat. You do still need treatment, though, for a gunshot. Is this all the corpses? I feel like this can't be all of them. There's 22 corpses on the map. 16 are here. No, this is not all of them yet. This is not all of them yet. And winter has properly begun now. Great. This is the time that we should be doing research, but we're not. Although, I don't even know if we'll get research done. It's hard snow. It's been a hard snow. And I imagine people are going to start trying to clear snow before they do research. So this may be a complete bust anyway. That goes all the way up. That goes all the way up. Construction does not go all the way up. That gets set as normal. So we'll get these all set. Uh, looks good to me. Except I gotta get a couple of these set. There. Perfect. Plants are dying in the cold. That's expected. It could stop snowing any time now, though. It's been snowing for, like, over a day. 
the snow can only get so deep. Land is taking care of flame. Uh, let's see. Oh, that was infection treatment, 100%. Good. So the infection is at 50% healed, only 23% lethal. Flame is going to be fine. He just needs time to recover. Also, how is this room doing? 45-ish degrees in here. And Canark started a fight with Katie. Stop it! Thank you. Thank you for that. As if we didn't have enough problems already. And Kinnerk, you started it. Alright, Spud just did surgery. And Pandora has a leg again. Still needs an arm, though. White is taking care of that. I mean, you're a good doctor. You got a 10 in medical, at least. So the odds are... better than a coin toss? Hopefully. Who is my best surgeon right now? Surgery success chance. Spud and White are the best ones to do it. Really like it if we could get this place cleaned up a little bit. Medical emergency is still Pilar and still Pandora. That's all because of the blood loss. Wait, I'm sorry, what happened here? I thought that White was doing this. Did you get bored halfway through? Well, let's hope that you're up to it. Bod and Katie are fighting. Can people stop fighting Katie, please? Alright, um, we have a prosthetic right arm. Left radius is still broken, though. And so, because the left radius is broken and gone, the efficiency is zero, which, I mean, without the radius, I don't know if there's going to be any manipulation in that arm at all. We may need to install a second prosthetic arm. Oh, do I? Hold on a second. What does everything over here require? Um... No, we don't really need these. Wait. Make a flashlight? It's mounted on the side... Or... On the ear side. You can make... We can make a flashlight. That's cool. Um... Make a black pearl? Improve... Uh, an improved artificial eye with unique elements... And a full side trigger. It brings a wide set of features, but the most outstanding is night vision. Huh. There's lots of stuff in here. Looks like all of it requires components. It requires... Plasteel. These are things that I could be bringing in here. Yeah, I could be bringing these in here. Actually, no, I'm not going to put those there like that. Let's put them right here. We'll put those right there, and then we'll be able to put whatever we need on these. Just like we have the um, the medicine stuff over here for the the uh, drug lab, we'll need to carry the stuff right here local for the, um, for the prosthetics lab. Or the prosthetics workbench, whatever it is. 
Pilar is no longer incapable of walking. Good. People are getting back up. And we've even got research going. Which is even more fantastic. We should probably do some preparations, actually. Um, here's what I'm thinking. I kind of want to put the, the computer right in the middle of the room. Actually, this is kind of a problem because I'm looking at the multi-analyzer and this thing is not reaching these. So we may have to change things around here again. I had considered this before, but now I think it's kind of necessary because we're going to need the middle of the room. Okay, that's that's fine, actually, because I have an idea for this. That can go there. Come on, let me go. That can go there. The chairs can move. The trash cans are actually kind of good where they are, but I'm going to have to move them anyway. Kind of the same with these. But these are kind of less important. Kind of less important, I say. Um... So, the interior here is 12. If I take away four from each side... That's where the multi-analyzer and the computer have to go. So here's what I'm thinking. The multi-analyzer is going to go right there. I can move some of this stuff. I hear somebody working down here. Flak pants. Great. Um, that's awesome. Let's keep working on this, though. Actually, the um, computer's going to have to go right here. Which means that these shelves can actually just move over here like this. Yes, yes, yes. Plants are dying. I don't need an update. Those can go right there. And there'll still be walking room to get around. How's the hospital looking? Empty? Not quite. Katie's in here. That's because Katie got all beat up. Seven's still in here because Seven just came back from the dead. And Klaus is in here because Klaus is paralyzed. Which is terrible. Um... You have so many points, but I thought we did all of this. Did I miss you somehow? Um, I guess I did. Well, that seems terrible. Well, let's go ahead and get you all tuned up then. Um, the next thing to do, I guess, will you learn how to summon a minion? So what does that do? What did we just learn? Uh, summons a minion to assist in daily tasks. Cool. Uh, so the enticing offer uh, controls the number and the quality of them I get, and Taskmaster increases the duration. Okay. Well, that's fine. And then the middle one is usually, yeah, it's usually efficiency. Okay, that's fine. And then we can learn Defense Pylon, which probably would have been useful before you got shot. I suppose you can use this now, can you? No, no you cannot. Now, if you could actually do that while um, laying in bed, that would be incredible. 
because then you could still like do things. All right, how are we doing on the research now? Oh, we just got the shells moved, so people are coming in to take care of that. I mean, I'm glad they are. Petros is in here doing research. Bod is in here doing research. And so is John. Good. And they're all going to get the benefit now of the multi-analyzer. So, this is perfect. Alright, um, up here, clean up. 22 corpses are up here. Strip them all, and then let's burn them. I know, this is basically what we did last time, but strip them all. Because some of them are going to have some armor. What do we got here? Trooper armor. Trooper armor. Marine armor. I mean, this is what we really want. There's flak armor over here. This is great stuff. Great stuff. What is this? A ranged shield belt. That's even better. So yeah, there's all kinds of advanced armor in here that we can use. All we have to do is wash it, and it's good. And armor is one of the few things that we are not recycling. As long as it's at least normal quality, it's wearable. Running, 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 good. Doesn't actually tell me what the contents are. Doesn't matter. I was curious. Alright, Liss is back to work on this. Anything normal quality, we're just going to turn into scrap. And there's some poor quality armor over here, too. There is a normal quality Siege Breaker helmet. That is some of the heaviest armor that you can get. Not too much, there's a lot of flak vests. Everybody at this point should be wearing at least a flak vest, I think. Like if I check this... Um, actually, no, it still says that we need a flak vest. I wonder if this is set for a good flak vest. And somebody's a traitor? Somebody is, in fact, a traitor. Okay, well. Everyone can attack, then. You don't have to feel bad about this one. KLM. Fox, get out of there. All right, he's dead. Everyone go back about your business. Fox, you did get stabbed, I think. Where did you go? There you are. Fox. Um, not stabbed. He tried, but you only ended up with a bruise. You'll be fine. I mean, you open up your home to people, and this is what happens. I'm surprised that no one is using this thing. I turned everybody up for research and nobody touches the ground penetrating scanner. Uh, it's, it's incredible. I don't know why. I mean, is it because we don't have a good enough chair there? I mean, I can fix that. I 
I can go ahead and put a roof over here, and we can put a better chair here. Which, I mean, right now we have no chairs, so anything is better. Oh yeah, I also forgot. The theater is no longer a theater. Do we have anything that we can place back over here? No. No, we don't. The best I have is... A tube television. It's terrible. Disappointing. So, we don't have a theater anymore. It's just an empty room until we can get another one. I still have a, we still have a good rec room, so I'm not too worried about it. And, I mean, Flame is over there right now. So, it's good. Land making repairs. John is over here doing research, so is Pittman. I would like to at least get this computer system done before we have to leave today, okay? That's that's the goal. It's not a huge goal. This should be achievable. Also, Gustav is in labor. Did I how did I miss this? What are you doing? You're wandering. Would you go to the hospital? Oh, you're almost done. Solarian. Rescue. Building is unusable due to roof? I, I don't have time for this. Gustav is in labor. Gustav was wandering around for some reason instead of reporting to the hospital herself. Which I thought they did. And drop the baby on the way. Brett, would you please put this baby somewhere safe? I can't believe that's how this thing went. Um, however, it's a healthy baby. It literally just fell out while we were carrying Gustav. Um, name the baby. It's going to be Marulo. Sure, sounds good. And if I find your house... Okay, you're already bringing the baby back here. Perfect. That's what I wanted. Also, this entire room is freezing. We never put this in here. Find desserts have rotted away. It's fine. We can make more. All right, we can clear that out because Gustav is no longer in labor. And a crash opportunity. We have... All, we we got to do with this stuff over here. We can't go chasing after things like that. Okay, now, building unusable due to roof. This thing has to be unroofed, apparently. Well, it was a good idea. Remove roof. I can still, um... I can still put something over here, though. So, we have these cloth armchairs. Will this entice anybody to come over here and do this? If I put an armchair there. All right, and Marulo is snug in a crib. Fantastic. Well, you're going to have an interesting story when you grow up. Okay, there we go. That's usable again now. All right, back to work on that. The research is what's killing us right now. Nelicus, you're still working on flak vests. And that's an excellent one, so that's good. How are we doing up here? Uh, marine armor.
Are we getting a lot of this armor repaired? I mean, you better be repairing it. Poor flak pants. It's, we'll, we'll destroy those. Void helmet. Normal. I'm not sure what that is. Let's take a look. A helmet made out of an antimatter composite. Even Glitter World planets struggle to understand and use the technology that allows antimatter composite to so effectively deflect kinetic and energy projectiles. Can be used as an EVA helmet in outer space. Wow. Okay, then. I mean, that sounds really important. All right, um... Well, I'm just going to let people take care of things over here. I believe Lissa was working on this. Lissa should be able to take care of everything there. No one's getting any research because it's nighttime and everyone's going to sleep. Medical treatment needed. Petros, what's wrong with you? Oh, it's your anxiety. I, I get that. I'm anxious too. And Maruto is hungry. Well, we should have baby food somewhere. I don't know why that is forbidden. I don't even know where that knife came from. Oh wait, I thought that's the knife that was the um that guy tried to use to stab Fox with. That's probably it. Alright, do we have baby food? We should. Yes we do. The only question is where? And I bet I know where. Yeah, it's over here. Because um Bai is taking care of kids. Where's your partner again? Who is your partner again? Son, daughter, ex-lover is Zakyle. Who are your parents? Bai and Zakyle. Okay, yeah, that makes sense then. Single mother. Right? Yeah. Alright, well, we're just going to have to deal with this. We can move this over here, though. Oh, wait. Gustav is over here, and Gustav can breastfeed. Never mind. Everything is fine. And here comes somebody to finally install the heat. Perfect. So that should warm this place up really quick. I hope. 44, 39, 50. It's fluctuating a lot. There's a roof on everything, right? No open doors or anything like that. Okay, it's it's warm in here. It's warm enough. Okay, with everyone awake, is anybody coming down here to do research? Because this is like all I care about right now. Oh, and we did get a chair installed up here. So, I mean, running out of reasons not to scan for things. Except for, I guess, the fact that obviously... Research is at such a low priority. Even if I do put it all the way up to one. Looks like everything's been cleared out, though, here. More or less. Um, we're storing a whole bunch of clothing over here. That's not exactly ideal, but I guess we're out of room. We do have full coverage here, yeah. So we can sell some clothing if we come across a ship that's willing to buy some.
All right, perfect. Pittman is back here. How close are we to this research? Um, just a hair over halfway. Can I please get people to come in here and do this? And research is one of the few things that you cannot force people to do. If you try, it says research is a long-term task. You can't prioritize it. By which I guess they mean you would die if you just sat there the entire time. Um, let's see. Up here. I forgot. I need to do these. Um, actually, I don't want these, um, these, these things. The reason being is they're going to store too much material and I don't need that. I can do this better if I just throw stuff on the floor. It doesn't look as nice, but it's more useful. Because I only need to have one stack of things here. Okay. Stockpile time. One, two. Three, four. Perfect. Clear all. We're going to make this critical. Clear all. Critical. Just copy and paste. Okay. So this one is going to be steel. This one is going to be plasteel. This one is going to be components. And the last one, I don't know what we're going to need yet. We need steel, plasteel, and components to make all of our basic prosthetics. Bionics require the original plus more plasteel and more components, so that should get us all the way up to the bionic level. When it comes to the cybernetic level, then we need titanium, which we don't have any of, and I pretty much sold all of it. So that just leaves some of this other stuff. The green thumb, compression jaw, that all requires gold and advanced components. I don't know that we need that stuff, though. Right now, we just need to have limbs that people can use. That's all I really care about. So people will go ahead and they'll bring the stuff up there. I've got three people in here researching. How fast is that ticking up? Pretty quickly, actually. I can actually see the bar moving. What's that? A stellar miner. Um, good. We can use that, too. Anna, would you give them a call? Problem is, we don't really have that much in the way of money. Got 4,700 silver and less than a thousand gold. So, what we can buy may be limited. Wait and see if Anna can get that call in. Right now she's eating, which is fine. Go ahead and get something to eat. We have plenty of food. The cheese is gone. I think people enjoyed that. But we have enough rice. We can keep making milk. Our, how many of these are actually working? That one's working. That one's working. The rest of them don't. All right, here we go. Stellar Miner. Perfect. Um, we can sell you a whole bunch of stuff to cover our debts. Iron ore, they don't have any. If they don't have iron, though, they might have steel. Do they not have steel? Really? Hold on. Steel. They have plas... No. Yes, they have plasteel. 
no, who are selling Plasteel to them. They don't actually sell steel. And they don't have any iron either. Then it's like, why are you here? Well, you know what we can do? We have a whole bunch of elephant leather. If I sell that to you, that's worth a lot. A whole bunch of lizard skin. If I sell it to you, it's worth a lot. I'm going to dump both of those on you, and here's what I do want to do. Slate blocks. I'm going to buy those from you. And granite blocks. I'm going to buy those from you. And after that, I don't really know. Um, gold? Sure, I guess we'll buy the gold. That's gonna... Wow, okay, maybe we can't do that much. Um, I have a whole bunch of textiles, though, that I can sell. So let's sell all of our textiles except for things like, you know, our synthetic fibers. He's not gonna buy the actual clothing, but this is gonna clear out a lot of space for us. Uh, so yeah, the Ultra Weave, we're gonna keep. We're gonna keep that, keep that, keep that. We're gonna keep all of those. So that is 6,600, almost 6,700. If we take all the gold, it's a negative 9,000, so we're only looking like 40%. Um, Divided by 10 is 120, times 4 is going to be like, say, 500? Yeah, that works. And technically, I can take a little bit more. A little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. Perfect. So, we're going to get rid of all of that. We're going to pick up some blocks that we can use for construction. And we're going to pick up some gold to help refill our coffers. It's not the way I wanted this to go down, but I'm going to make it work. Besides, we still have um, blueprints over here that need to get done. So we should be able to put away the gold. We should be able to put away the granite. And all of these slate blocks should go straight to work. All right, and marriage is on. Alan is marrying Katie? <gasps> no way. We have watched Katie grow up this entire time. She was a child when she came to us. Solarian and Amara took her in. Oh, right, and then there's you. Um, you people. Right. I think I'm going to get rid of you. You can go away. Um, what about you? Cannibal? You can definitely go away. Go ahead and get out of here. It'll improve our relations with other people, too. Although, I am sending them out naked and it's negative 12 degrees outside. They will never survive the trip home. But I can't really dress them. So, there's nothing I can do about that. As long as they leave this map healthy, they'll be fine. So, I guess it'll depend on how long it takes for, um, for Frostbite to set in. It takes about that long for Frostbite to set in. I should have waited till daytime. You know what? Don't care, though. Get out of here. I'm not taking care of you anymore. All right, well, I was hoping to have the computer researched before we left, but I'm basically out of time, so I don't know that that's going to happen. Oh, hey. Um, exit the map healthy? Exit the map healthy. I guess Frostbite doesn't count. Well, that improves our relations with Giladon. Yeah, I do wonder if maybe I could be improving relations with them by um, sending them stuff. Both of these are full. 
We just don't have that much of a use for this stuff now. I suppose instead of using actual slate blocks, I could be using synthetic um, roadways. The problem is I actually kind of wanted the slate blocks for um, for roads because they act as a fire break. All right, we're back to work at research. Probably the last day of research we're going to get. John is in here working. Products have finished. Awesome, we're getting lots of soup. We're doing really good when it comes to food in general. Fine meals and fine soups all over the place. As a matter of fact, half of the problem that I see is when people come in to eat, they're these this ends up um being overused. I have an idea, actually. See, every single one of these holds the same amount. So if you have a double shelf, it holds six. If you have a single shelf, it holds three. I could divide this up better. And that would allow more people to access over here at any given time. So I'm just thinking logistically here, we would be, uh, be doubling the amount of access points. In theory, at least. In theory. You know, I would like to see this place being completely used at some point. If I could get six people in here doing research, it would be magical. As it is, the most I've ever seen is three, which is still better than it used to be. Oh, wait, here comes Pittman. That's four. And look at the way research is cranking along with four people in here. Eh, it, I knew it couldn't last. It's fine, it's fine. Are we out of wood? We shouldn't be out of wood. No, we're not out of wood. Masterwork shelf? I mean, that's great and all, but <laughs> I don't need the shelf to be masterwork. I just need it built. If somebody would please come and build this last one, you wouldn't have to climb over shelves to get your lunch. Please. Just somebody come and build this shelf. Okay, thank you. Now, I'm going to copy this. I'm going to paste this over all of these. And then this one and this one can go away. So those should get deconstructed and moved to all of these shelves, and then we'll just shove them back against the wall. Oh! Oh! You grew up? You've reached the age of three! Awesome! You're going to need a bed. You're going to need a bed. And that means that this can go over to Gustav's house now. So which house was that? That was this one. Perfect. Um, so I don't need the baby foot. I need the actual shelf. Perfect. Go ahead and put that right there. All right, so you, um, Gulo can now do those. I need to make sure that, where are you at? There you are. 
you are restricted to the home area. Do not go wandering outside, it's dangerous out there. And because of that, because of who and what you are, the Prime Bunker is now active. And obviously you're going to remain one of us. So the Prime Bunker is now active. That means that we're going to need to have a trader in here somewhere. Awesome. And all those shelves are gone, so now we can start moving these. Okay, we'll put those back. And this should improve things over here greatly. Perfect. Now more people can access it. We've doubled the access points. It just occurred to me, we do have a TV in here, so we're not completely without television watching. We just don't have our theater anymore until we can replace that. So how close are we to getting this research? Uh, very close, but I don't think we're going to get it. Not today. Because we're running out of time again. However, we would now want the absolute image, which means that we might need to build ourselves another temple. But you know what? Building another temple is not the worst thing in the world. And I was right. We did use that slate to immediately build these roads. All right. Well, we can do that. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to take a break. When we get back... We'll get the research done for the new computer system, and that's going to aid our research even further. Because that computer system aids to unlock new technologies and provides a research boost. So it will increase the speed of our research even further. We're going to need a temple for the Prime Bunker. I'm thinking it'll be up here somewhere because we have the space. And this is just a good place for it, I think. So we'll do that, we'll take care of them, and there's the authoritarian party. So that's a dance party that we can do. And dance parties are always good. Alright, but for today, we're going to have to go ahead and take a break. So, we actually achieved a fair amount today, despite the, the beginning. We got attacked, it was bad, we do have some casualties from that. No one's dead, but we do have one paralyzed. And so that that that's really that that sucks. We're gonna have to work on the research to fix that. Once we get the computer system, that should be a lot easier. Other than that though, we had a birth right out in the middle of the open. In in the combat center of of our city. I just I don't know why they didn't go to the hospital themselves, but there we are. And we're doing good on research. So, if you want to see how things turn out next time, subscribe to the channel. You know what to do. Just hit the bell icon. If you know somebody else who would also enjoy this, either they're into RimWorld or the Wheel of Time, then share it with them. But otherwise, though, if you just like what I'm doing, leave a like on the video, leave a comment down below. I will see you next time for the Rim of Time. And until then, take care.